Ah, it's the ocean. What a vast and wondrous world. And with that in mind, what's up everyone? I'm Fearless Falcon and welcome back to Sub Friggin Nautica. We are going live now because we can. Ah, no, stop. No, 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 la, 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 la. No one should have heard that. No one heard that. Anyway, we're live with Subnautica. <laughs> Good lord. This is what happens when I try to be like anything. Loading. Things are loading. Oh. I completely forgot. We just killed the Reaper Leviathan last episode, Welcome didn't we? Aboard, Captain. Didn't we? Yeah, I got the photographic proof of it right there. It's dead. Oh, gee, let's scan for a wreck. Gee, I don't know where a wreck could be. I wonder. Uh, all right, that was a bad joke. That was a terrible joke, actually. Can I friggin' like? Ew. Can we not? Can we? Can we take the creep vine, eat it because it's disgusting, and why would I do that? Because I hate myself, obviously. Um, and can we? Just plant some stuff and move on. Okay, cool. Oh, come on! That was absolutely... I landed in the water. I was operating on Minecraft rules, wasn't I? Mm -hmm. Okay. I saw a hoverfish and a boomerang together and I thought it was some sort of weird sea scorpion thing. Of course! Of course. It's never, you know, the giant monsters that want to eat me for breakfast, or like, the, the, the crazy, uh, island-sized things that jump out of nowhere, or even, even something like the, the friggin' It's never any of that. It's... Oh no! There's a normal fish! That would explain why the volume's so low. It's like, oh no, a normal fish. Whatever will I do? <laughs> Alright, back to the nest. I don't... Why is my sea moth all the way over there? I forgot my sea moth! Give me back my moth! Please. Thank you. You're very polite. Gimme! Aw, oh, again with the weird, like, glitch on the Seema. I never understood that. Alright, bing! It's not as good as Google. Bing! Oh, yeah. We got this. We got solar power. We got the... And our crush depth is 900 meters. Which, if it's not obvious, means that there is no way that we can be crushed. Unless we go really, really deep. And last I checked... Because, you know, I don't know much, but, you know, the only, the only place that we needed to go, that we need to go, isn't that deep. Welcome aboard, Captain. Blech. So, we are going to go and stash all of this junk, and see where we go from there. 
Where is the titanium box? There it is. Where's the titanium box? That sounds like a weird question to ask. Then again, isn't everything a weird question to ask? I mean, someone had to ask everything at some point, so it, it, it's... Look, I don't friggin' know, okay? I gotta, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta fill the time with, with just, just idle banter, and no one is saying any... And there goes the bulbo tree. Great! Absolutely needed that. All right. Well, uh, the light is almost out of power, but now it's not because we're awesome. <laughs> That's a hot take. Can uh, do I need to repair this? Nah. I got 94%. What's the point? Proposed Degasi Habitat, 500 meters down. We do have a rebreather, right? Yes, we do. Ow! Okay, now I actually need to fix the damn thing. Can I, like... It's like my favorite thing so far in the game. It's, it's, it's such a fast underwater vehicle, and I can see for miles! <coughs> well, actually, not miles. The map's only two kilometers. High Warper. Oh, there's gonna be bad stuff. I need to turn off my light and go to sleep. Nope. Big old fat load of no. What the hell is this place? What are these things? They look like. I don't even know what these are. Balloons? Anchor pod. Nothing better be right behind me, ready to munch my butt. No one's allowed to do that without permission. And here's a spoiler alert. None of you have permission to do that. Well, aside from being horribly creepy, this place does have a sort of eerie beauty to it. Isn't there supposed to be a habitat down here? Thank you. Ooh. What the fudge is that? What are those? Why are you going way over there? Hi. Um. 
Bing. Do they see me? I think they see me. Detecting a titanium mass somewhere in this area. Unable to confirm whether it originated on the Aurora. Okay, but more importantly, there's these big weird crab things. They look like they've got like five head IQ. I need to get in there. Nope. Alien containment. Oh, sweet. Are you like right outside the window? You better not be. Oi, caramba! Hi, buddy. How are you? Hi. Can I scan you? Can I? Oh, they're both here. That's fantastic. Did you just EMP my friggin' light? Oh, more colored stuff. Hey, one of these things. My light's off again. Nuclear waste disposal, cool. I just picked up an egg. I don't know what it does. Are you looking in the window again? God damn it. I can't see anything. Light. I need light. For just a second. I'm sorry. Uh, oh, you are right there. Uh-uh, we are moving the ship. here now I think I've been spotted shoot I've been spotted nope I'm gonna dart around you and go and come back later bye are you still behind me oh I thought the anchor pod was one of them Bing! Tell you what, I'm gonna go over here. And you can have your grand old time over there, and I'll just sit here and wait. And you can stay there. And I didn't see a way into the lower floor, so it's gotta be over here or something. Yeah! Lights on! Swim charge fin! Pick up carry all. I don't need a carry all. Anything else? Of note? Nothing? Hi! You're very large and frankly terrifying. And right behind me! Oh, shoot, he is! <laughs> oh, Jesus. Welcome aboard, Captain. No. Oh, good, there's a warper. What are you guarding? What? The oh, jeez, there's two of them. That's bad. Dodge and weave, folks. What the garbage is this? There's, like, green goo on the floor. There's like, whoa. Whoa! Okay. This doesn't look remotely deadly. Or spooky, or anything. I'm not prepared for this kind of an expedition. Cool. Can we, like, not? Are you dangerous? You look like the other rays. 
Are you dangerous? Can I, like, interact with you? Can I scan you? Ghost Ray! Ah, oh, cool. Anything down here? Okay, death! Death is down there! Fantastic! Get back in my friggin' Seamoth, and away we go. Bing! Man, this cavern goes on forever! Bing! Bing! This place is huge! Bing! Whoa! Oh no! No, I know what that is! No, 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 Turning around! We are turning around and we are not effing with that thing! Buzz off! We're going this way. Is there something over there? Hold on. Expert vision. Bing. Yeah, there's something over there worth investigating. First off, I want to scan this. What the hell is this, first off? Ancient skeleton. Oh yeah, I can definitely see something over there. I don't know what it is. Hmm. Insert tablet. Oh, orange! I have that! I hope I can make more of those. I can make more of those, right? Yes, I can. I need nickel. I don't have nickel. Oh, wow. There's a lot of cool stuff in here. Another one of those weird eggs. Ion cubes. Data terminal. Fauna reproductive data. Integrating Alien the bone specimen data. case. Well, this was definitely worth coming down. What is this freaking thing? Are you dangerous? Or are you just, like, there? You seem more like decoration than anything else. Alien research equipment. Alien research equipment. Alien research equipment. Alien research equipment. And this is... what? Is this some kind of map? Hang on. I'm gonna take a picture of this, because this might be a map of some kind. I can't decode it! But, you know, might be useful in the future, who knows. Alright, cool. Awesome. Well, I clearly can't go into the green gunk. So we'll have to make do. Can the sea moth go into the green gunk? Well, we're not taking damage. Ooh, there's stuff here. Hang on, if I like zip out. No, 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 is down there with the aqua tornado now I gotta stage a daring rescue mission back down there uh signal proposed Degasi habitat 500 meters 
This is gonna be really stupid. But you know what? No one ever said that genius needed to be smart. Oh, this like the definition of genius. Shut up! There wasn't anything like super deadly other than those weird crabs. So if I can make it back down. If I can make it down, around, past the habitat, down through that little cave system, and... Oy, caramba, hello! Heat? Heat is bad! Oh, F you! down here. Should never have gotten out of the sea moth. Oh, come on! You were right there! Ooh, what's this thing? Hello. Okay, hi! Warpers. They are not fun. Can I just say that? Like, the warpers are unfun. They are negative fun. No. Oh, come on. Why are you all here? No, join the freaking party! I'm gonna dodge and weave on my way down, and you can't touch this! Yeah. Almost there! Just 20 seconds! And we'll be on top of the damn thing! Then all we gotta do is dive under the weird gunk, get on board, and up we go! Buckle up! Seamoth can't take that stuff. Did I get my stuff back? Or is it all like down here on the open floor? Welcome aboard, Captain. No, where are my creature eggs? Oh no! Where are my eggs? Oh jeez. Are they back in here? If I go back, with the eggs back. No, my weird eggs. 
I needed those! At least I kept my eye on cubes! It's fine, Falcon. You have one more of those eggs. It's back at base. You got everything you needed. Why are we still on fire? Why is the sea moth still on fire? We are bleeding HP! Is it because we didn't get out of the, of the weird gunk? Like, do I need to like go down, dip all the way under, and then come back out? There we go. Ah, crap. We're bleeding health. I need to get back to base. A-S-A -A now. That expedition was damn near useless. I found two eggs and three ion cubes and then I lost the eggs. And we are still bleeding health. At a much lower rate, but we are still bleeding out. And that's very, 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 very bad. Oh good, another one of those Fs. Oh no! I saw that! How about no? UF right off. What a big fat load of no. Healthy dose of no. Thank you. We are still bleeding HP. Am I going to have to rebuild my freaking Seamoth? How about I get out of the water? How about that? How about I get out of the water? Cause splash! Cause splash! Oh my god. Oh my god. We are still bleeding! die on me? Am I just gonna have to deal with a perpetually dying Seamoth? No! No! Aqua Tornado! You're still bleeding! God, my Seamoth is not stopping the bleeding. It's just gonna bleed forever. Great. I guess I gotta build a freaking new one. Here, tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna take a nap. Zzz, sleeping. I can't hear you, I'm sleeping. I'm gonna go over here and if it's 
still freaking bleeding, then we're just gonna consider it sacrificed. Yeah, I'm the typhoon. Done for. All systems online. Well, time to just ram this thing into stuff until it blows up. Bonk! Bonk! Oh no, not the base! Bonk! Well, that sucked. Can I can I scan my own fragments of my seamoth, or is it just gone forever? Well, it doesn't matter. It was bleeding. Last thing wouldn't stop. Uh, now I gotta make another one. Cyclops, bronze suit, sea moth, titanium ingot, power cell, glass, lubricant, and lead. One of these eggs. Okay, that's that's fine then. As long as I have one. Okay, well, great, fine. I have a titanium ingot. I have. Do we have lead? Well, we gotta have lead lying around here somewhere. Silicone rubber, I need to make a power cell, and then lubricant, I can just get outside. Oh, I can get. I. I <coughs> ah! Ow! I sneezed so hard, I physically hurt my throat. Ah! What's on the radio? Okay, fine. Oh, do we have the translation now or something? Hello. This is Life Pod 2 coordinates attached. We're way past our safe depth and bleeding O2. We'll have to swim for the surface, but it's 500 meters straight up. We'll make for the rendezvous and keep you posted. Out. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Whoa! That thing, that, that thing, that literally flung itself. It was just like, yeet, zoom. All right, so I need two times glass. What a pain in the glass this is turning out to be. Oh, what are you doing down here? Are you supposed to be over there in that area? Whoa, okay, yeah, you're over in that area too. Great, fantastic, thank you. All right, cool. Well, now we don't have anything to drive. And not only am I out of things to drive, I don't have glass. So I can't make something to drive with. Two glass, right? That's four quarts. I 
see you. I'm not gonna bother you, okay? No, I said I wasn't gonna bother you. Go away. I said, listen, listen, I am not going to bother you. I'm just getting quartz. And what do they do? They freaking screech and then rammed me at like maximum velocity. I have, I have no words. Oh, I forgot that weird thing. That weird, like, brain tree thing. I think it was called a membrane tree. Probably. This game is big on the puns. Fabricate me some glass. that we require to make another sea moth. We're not talking about what happened to the first one, okay? We're just gonna pretend it never happened. Sea moth. Huh? I swear to God, if this one is bleeding too, then I'm, I just Welcome aboard, Captain. Yeah! Sea Moth! Alright. Now we just need to plug everything back in. Crush Jeff 900. Uh. Aqua Tornado 2? Why is Caps Lock on? Aqua Tornado... Two! One. Uh, two. <laughs> God, I can't believe I screwed up. I can't believe I lost my thing to some weird, like, graphical problem. Eh, it's just the Aqua Tornado. It's always, it always has been and always will be. Onward! And then this one starts bleeding just because it has the same name. <laughs> Alright, well, we're not going that way again. Oh, wait! I can build one of those, uh, uh, the th habitats. Oh no, 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 You are not hurting this thing. Buzz off. You hickory doodah day. I can build one of those, uh, the alien containments. As soon 
assuming I find enough quartz for it, but, you know, there's plenty of quartz lying around. Oh, are you infected? I'm so sorry. Integrating new PDA data. La 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 la, swimming this way, I'm so sorry, la la la. Oh hey, one of these, another egg. I'll take eggs, I like eggs. Eggs are delicious, if served properly. And by properly, I mean like, just leave me alone, leave me out of this, please. Let's Making the splash! There we go. Back to base! Hello? Room for my alien containment thing? No, huh? Well, I'll tell you what. We got we got this empty room here, so we got we got a room for it. Welcome aboard, Captain. So, what do I do? Alien containment. Glass times five, titanium times two. Oh, jeez. That's a big ask in the glass department. Whatever this is better be friggin' worth it. Let's out the game. Oh, no, we're out. We're done. We good. How much glass did I make? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten exactly. I can build two. I need titanium. Of course I need titanium for it. Duh. Okay, I have a radio message. Cool. Play partially translated broadcast. Yeah, it'd be me. You're welcome. Aquariums provide an ideal opportunity to study alien fauna up close. Select carefully which life forms you bring on board. They may also be studying you. Add a hatch to enter. Okay, cool. Uh. Before I do that, I'm going to add a second multi purpose room on top of this. Cause I'm awesome like that and I want more fish. Thermal plant converts heat to energy at medium efficiency. And a solar panel that we can actually keep above the water. Honestly, keeping a solar panel at water level like this would be horrible for it. But it's a video game. So who cares?
Next question. Do we have any more quartz? Because I need a hatch. Which is one quartz. Just one. Please? I am out of quartz. Of course I am. Of course I am! Why wouldn't I be? One friggin' thing. Guess what? I can find one quartz. That's not a difficult task. Hell, I could probably find like five. Stalker teeth! Totally fine enough. I just need one. One is all I require. Please be kind. Be kind. I said be kind, not be vicious and much. Alright, well, uh, I can't freaking find any quartz again. Here we go. The ever, the, the endless struggle. One quartz. I'll take it. And a stalker tooth. My inventory's full. I don't care. I'm going home. Because I just realized I'm probably really close to the crash zone right now, and that's the last thing I want. Ooh, no thanks. I am fine without that. It's kind of a problem on my shoulders. That's not. How? Come on home. Swim on home. Be cool about it and swim home. We got a ladder. We got a hatch. We got another ladder over here because why not? We got another alien containment. And of course we're too titanium short. As usual, I'm like just barely short on the resources I need. Will you let me pick the thing? Thank you. Kind sir. Alright. That's cool, I guess. So what do I just drop the eggs in? Let's see. Uh, one of you. One of you. One of you. One of you. Mm -hmm. How many can it hold? We'll, we'll put like some of this stuff in here so I can hold this one. And then I need, uh, uh, one, two, three. Perfect! Now we just drop all the eggs. Dun, 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 dun. Who knows what kind of wonders we'll experience in a few, uh, however long it takes those things to effing hatch. Where did I 
put my... There they are. So if I just, like, go sleep... Let's speed things along. Will, will these things hatch? Do something. Do something. Come on. It's fine. Still burning energy, aren't you? Well, none of them have hatched. Everything is still just like, okay, cool. Well, fine. Fine. I'll make my own friggin' fun. Welcome aboard, Captain. What do I need for a Cyclops and a prawn suit? If I wish to make a Cyclops, I require three Plasteel, three Enameled Glass, one lubricant, one advanced wiring kit, and three lead. A prawn suit is slightly easier, it looks like. You know what I need to make? I need to make a beacon in case I find something super useful. Because, you know, if I find something good that I can't stand to leave, it'll be important to mark it for later. There we go, beacon! Bacon. Alright, well, we got plenty of stuff, I guess. Welcome aboard, Captain. So we got two options. We can go to Life Pod 12, sunk to the ocean bed at 250 meters. Or we can go like ah Life Pod 2 at 500 meters down. I see Life Pod 2. Again, Life Pod 12 is... Hmm. We'll start with 12 and move on to 2. Well, that's close to the Aurora. That's fine, I have my scanner now. I can ping stuff. So I can know if there's gonna be a problem. Hopefully. Possibly. I'll do it again, damn it. Bing. Bing.
rank fine before we dive down. Is that a reef back? Sweet! Reef back means health. A healthy zone that won't kill me. Oh. Deep. Deep area. Bushes. Oh, have I already scanned these? Huh. Well, there's a shipwreck over here. <laughs> so, you know, if I wanted to do that, I could. Let's do that. signatures in the region. Exercise caution when diving deeper. Cool. How about instead of exercise caution, we just do the thing? Whoa, this bulb bush is ginormous! There's got to be a way into the ship, right? Locked. Locked. There's no way in? Aww. Lame. How is... Whoa, what is that? I'm going to guess that's dangerous. It looked like it had electricity all over it. I don't want it shocking my Seamoth to death. I already... Had it die once. Bong. Well, there's one right there, so I can probably scan it before it gets too close. What are you? Amp eel. Hi. Can I scan you? And maybe not have you kill me? Yeah, you know, I, I just I just want to get close. Just hold still. Oh, you're gonna try and hurt me, aren't you? It's fine, all I need is the There, I got I got it, 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 I got what I needed. Uh here's the life pod. Ooh, that's dense volcanicness. <laughs> ay, ay. Okay, how about I back the F up a little bit? How about no? How about you buzz off? Captain Zappy Pants. Come on! Abandon PDA! Integrating new PDA data. That's it, that's it, that's everything there is in there, apparently. What a crappy life pod! I think it was possible to suck that much. Oh, 
well, at least we still have the reef backs. I mean, there's some caves here, I guess. Ah, eh, probably worth investigating for some reason or another. inside a long calcified root system. Evidence suggests it was eaten away by other life forms over many centuries to form these natural caves. Crap, 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 I have an egg! La 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 la! Ow! Oh, it's probably the middle of the night now, isn't it? Isn't it? Oh, it's not? Huh. It's not. Ain't that nice. It's actually dawn. see the light of day again. <laughs> We're gonna have to start diving deeper soon, I bet. That means a lot of bad stuff. Hi, Reef Back! close these biomes are to each other. Like, less than 200 meters, less than two football fields away from where I landed, is a giant, monstrous, like, I don't even know what those things, what reef backs are supposed to be. Like, they're like a weird mix between like a manta ray and an entire, like, and like a turtle and like an entire coral reef all at once. And it's like amazing and cool and fantastic and, ah! Did I seriously just? Did I seriously run myself over? With my own sea moth and die. What the ever living? I'm. I have to clip that. I have. To, I absolutely have to clip that. But like, no. <gasps> the egg survived. Some of the eggs hatched. <gasps> some of the eggs hatched. Crash fish. Cuttlefish. I can pick it up. Small and gray colored herbivore where the cuttlefish displays high levels of intelligence, curiosity, and attachment. Strangely, this species has not been encountered in the wild, and the scanned specimen had to be artificially hatched within an alien containment unit. The absence of wild specimens little can be known for certain about the cuttlefish's life cycle. It is possible that environmental conditions have changed, forcing the species to the edge of extinction and leaving its eggs in permanent stasis. Highly 
highly social, interspecies interactions, and this deserves an Earth dolphins before their extinction. This creature seems to understand the concept of other minds, a prime indicator of true sentience, and attempts to communicate with a series of chirps and chirrups. Interaction. Evidence suggests the cuttlefish is capable of understanding and following some commands, as well as assessing the emotional state of individuals around it, responding in kind. Please get off of my screen, you giant flying doodad. Well, can I, like, take you and, like... Do I, like, put you outside or something? Come on, go into the open water. Watch out in the open ocean or whatever. Alright, let's see what happens if I do this. Can I just put, put you out here and look? Oh, you're adorable! Play with fish. Play with fish? When did I get a cracker? Oh, you're cute! Oh, you're adorable! Just follow me around? Here, you stay here. You stay around here, okay, buddy? Just, just stay in that general area. Guard the farm. I can't... I can't... Oh, the clip's done. I gotta trim it. Hang on. I'm thinking of title driving problems. And then from there we can hop back right into the stream and be good to go. How long has my oxygen been draining? Oh jeez. Deep breath. around that I can use versus what do I need to burn off. And more of these. I don't know what they do, but they exist. Um, I guess I need to make some plasteel. Like, what do I need for a cyclops? The cyclops. Plasteel ingot times three, enameled glass times three, lubricant, advanced wiring kit, and lead times three. I have none of those. I can easily get the lead, the lubricant, and the advanced wiring kit. Okay, so, uh, what do I need for a prawn suit? I can do that, too. 
I just need a source of glass. Other than the alien containments, because I don't want to risk that. You seem so happy in there. And I'm sure that as soon as I start adding in predators, they'll just be like, oh no. You're still just swimming around out there, huh? That's adorable. glass so uh, I, that, that obviously means that I need to acquire a thing of quartz a, a vast quantity of quartz also screw you for running me over Welcome did I actually just damage my own Sima? <laughs> the damage is from what I ran myself over not do that again, ever. God, I, I feel so stupid having legitimately ran myself over with a steam up. I was at, like, almost full health, too. Like, there is no conceivable reason why I should have died there, but no. Bing. Bopped my friggin' externals. Alright, so 500 meters down before she had to abandon it. Jeez. That's gotta be a sucky way to go. You get in your life pod expecting to be to like land on an ocean planet expecting to live and not only do you sink 500 meter half a kilometer straight down which would the, the depth the depth pressure alone would probably kill you without like future tech and then on top of that on freaking top of that there's probably like Sand sharks and and those weird like big-headed squids and and some other third thing down there, and I'm just like, bruh. Oh, this place is pretty big and wide open. There are more ancient floaters around here. Oh, this is big. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Jelly ray, stalker, bone shark, castle pod, sand shark, crab squid, crab snake. Catch him, catch him, gotta catch him all. <laughs> gotta catch him all. Ah! I'm trying to make a pokey rap joke. How dare you? Is that a wreck over there? It is. Ooh, fascinating. So those floater thingies are sustaining these in the water, and somehow these rocks are just floating on their own. Got it, got it. Quartz? Quartz? Quartz. Yo! Land masses suspended here suggest they once floated on the surface. And there's like tech. Yeah. You're not quartz. You're annoyances. You're nuisances. How dare you? Boop. Alright, well, what can we find up here? More quartz! Ah, so the quartz exists on these parts. 
Oh, hi, thing. I think you're called Bone Sharks, but I don't remember. And I'd rather not get close enough to scan you, because I'm a little far from home at the moment. And, you know, the last time I did that, I effed up completely. I remember Seamoth led for like five hours, and I was not okay. And I just broke it on purpose, because I was just done with life. And then I ran myself over with the new one. It has been a great day for having a Seamoth. First it dies, then I get a replacement, and that one runs me over. You know, ain't I just a loser? <laughs> Prost grapple on fragment. Grapple. Prost grappling on fragment. Grapple. Fragment. New blueprint synthesized. I no longer have need for the rest of these. They're just titanium. I mean, I'll take the titanium. If I have room. Like, I don't know how much room I have in my, my loadout right now. I got plenty. Not, could you like not, please? Like I'm trying to have a day over here, and you're just like. <laughs> it's like cool, cool. Thanks. Have a good day. I need a laser cutter. Where's my laser cutter? Never go anywhere without your laser cutter. Yeah. One of these is gonna cut one of these open, and there's gonna be a warper in here. Like, what's up, what's up, bro? How you doing? Having a day? Oh, an entire prawn suit! WN safety instructions appendix A14. Don't climb on or get off equipment while it's moving. Gee! 30 seconds. I really could have used that advice like 10 minutes ago. You know, when I freaking ran myself over with a CMOD. Okay, I need to hang an immediate U turn because I am about to die. <laughs> Oh no, oh no! I got greedy! Where's my ship? <gasps> I am alive! Okay! I am alive! And that's what matters! Hi. Let's turn the lights off on this thing. Maybe install the repair tool. Maybe fix my dying machine because it's apparently effed up again. Yeah, let me just went back in here. Find out what's going on in the fun land. What's in here? 
I'm guessing not much. Open! Oh! A way out. Cool. <gasps> There's something in here. I can't get down there. Oh no, I don't have my... Uh, I don't have my propulsion cannon. Ah, fine. Probably just jump I don't need anyway. Where? Do I already have... Oh, I got an arm. Hey, yo! You just missed one of the stupidest moments of my gaming career. Okay, fine. The life pod sunk to 500 meters before she abandoned it. This is fine. I am perfectly fine with this scenario. I can dive to 500 meters. Five hundred meters is nothing. Is this the ocean? Is this more of that blood kelp? See, it's fine. It's just creepy. What's gonna jump at me? What? It's gonna jump out at me. Something's out there. Okay! Okay! Maybe we need to go down a bit. Hi! Are you still following me? Oh, I see you slinking off into the darkness. Ugh. <laughs> That is unfun. No. That thing was huge. Okay, maybe we maybe we put the beacon down here for deep sea exploration. Like this is where I want the the beacon to go. Like, hey, this is where the deep stuff is. Edit beacon name. Uh, Deep Cave. Ignore the giant glowy monster that wants to kill you forever. And murder your soul. I know it's gonna come charging at me and I'm gonna hate it. The thing is, like, I know what they are. I know exactly what they are. And I still hate them. A deep shroom. Ah! Oh, good, it's one of those big headed things Is it fighting the warper? Holy crud. Also, what are you doing down here? Ugh. I don't like them. Look, just let me get the life pod, okay? I'm going to I'm going to I'm going to Cyclops depth module 1. Oh, there's another one. There's two. I think I've been spotted. Crap. Yup. Hey. Nope. 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 You see nothing. No. Have yourself a good day, you EMP launching giant five headed. Welcome aboard, Captain. Ooh. Ooh. Lights off. 
They're attracted to light. I found that out. Are you just, like, sitting there? Okay, I need to save before anything else happens because... They're just there! They're just going to Okay, I got the data pad! Integrating new PDA data. Bye! Yeah, you saw me, didn't you? <laughs> we are not doing that again! <laughs> no, we are not. Buzz off. Big Ugly's still up here? Oh, I see you! You're way over there, though! You're even- you're- you're legitimately out of sonar range! Odds that you're gonna come after me at that rate? None. Let's get out of here. And- and hurry! Like, oh my wow! That was not a safe entrance. And the sad thing is, like, I know I have to go deeper. I'm gonna have to stage an expedition down that way. I'm going to have to actively build a submarine and go back there. With, like, no weapons! I have one knife! Granted, it killed the Reaper Leviathan, but I only have... Uh, one knife! That thing was huge! At least these things are huge, but peaceful! Hi, Reefbex. Thank goodness the Seamoth has solar power. Not like we'll be getting much while we're going. We're going underground into a cave system deep below the ocean surface where the light doesn't reach. And all we have are... Am I trying to be a dolphin? Uh, I'm actually just trying to get as much sunlight as possible to recharge this thing. down in the corner you can see that the battery is going up because I have a solar cell on this blasted device and it's less efficient if we're deeper. Alright, well, that was something. It was something. Something I do not approve of. Like a holy jeez. Yeah, cool, 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 cool. Cool! Can I check out my like little alien containment here? Hey! It's one of these things. A crab squid. Yeah, that, that makes sense. They're they're large and they're annoying. Data, please. Crab squid. This large predator can be found in deep waters where it lurks amongst the blood kelp and membrane trees in search of prey. It can deploy a powerful electromagnetic pulse to defend itself. Its ten limbs feature different appendages for swimming, walking, hunting, and possibly even tool use. Creatures caught in this grasp are expertly butchered and quickly consumed. Okay. Raise another illuminated herbivore as their usual prey and will approach and attack any light source in the vicinity. 
is EMP blasts is likely to develop a response to predation by creatures with electrical hunting mechanisms. While crab squids appear to have large brains and a resemblance to the intelligent squids of Earth, the organ inside the creature's head is in fact its stomach, which it must fill with startling regularity. Assessment neutralizes electrical equipment, lights attract its unwanted attention. Okay, and let's pretend that doesn't happen. Gasopod. Anything else that I need to scan around here? A crab snake! Hold still, let me scan ye. The crab snake! Alright, more importantly, I need stalker teeth. Double more importantly, I need to plant this deep shroom. Oh, I already have deep shrooms. Okay, cool. Cool. Great! Fantastic! I need to, like... Okay, the first thing I need to do is recharge the batteries on these blast devices. Scanner, battery out. Flashlight, no battery. Repair tool, battery off. Sea glide, battery off. Boop, 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 boop. Recharge or reload the batteries on everything. And then the habitat builder we don't need to do just yet. Okay, next question. Do we have everything we need to build something prawn suit wise? Front suit. Or Cyclops. How do I make an advanced wiring kit? I need to, I, I really need to like, sit down and be like, okay, what do you need? And it's like, okay, cool, I need this, that, and the other thing. And I need so much junk to make this thing, and I'm making a submarine. Are we really out of copper again? Because of course we are. Like, if it's not one thing, it's something else entirely. Yay, copper! Computer chip. Two gold and a wiring kit. That means I need one silver. Hopefully there's one lying around up here. There's not. Which means I have yet another expedition to go off on.
fine. That's the way they want to be. Now I'll just store all this junk. And we'll go off and we'll get stuff. I know I already, I know that there's like a drill arm that I need for the prawn suit, so I'm gonna go look for that, and then we'll go look for the other thing, and we'll find some silver on the way, and everything will be hunky dory. Let's get some water before we head out. Huh? Marble melon. Here your inventory so that we don't have to save, or we could save, I guess we can save. Save! Just in case, just in case, you never know when you're gonna need to save. Alright, fine. The floating island is over there. There's bound to be some wrecks lying around somewhere over there. Right? Like, they wouldn't... They wouldn't put all that junk over there and then be like, No, nah, there's nothing, bro. You know, given the fact that they have, like, sides for hands, it's probably, like, the least intimidating thing I can possibly tell them. He's like... Back off, bro. I got a knife. Oh, there you are. Hey, buddy. You want to play? How about no? How about you? How about you go your own way and I'll go my own way and I'll go up here? Let me in. Nope, no one here but us chickens. Laser cutter! right behind me. It better not be. Grappling arm fragment. Okay, cool. Guess who doesn't need a grappling arm fragment? This guy. Boop! Docking bay repair module. Okay. Cool. I already have a grapple arm, so I guess just cut through this door then. Why does this always take so long? I can hear it warping things. Grappling arm fragment. Oh, come on! There's nothing here! 
Yes, I know, you're there. I'm sorry I didn't get you flowers for Warper Day or whatever fudge. I am free! I'm probably going to be attacked immediately. Hello? Alrighty. Step one, we're not dead. Step two, uh... uh I don't know what step two is. Step two is try to surface and don't touch the bone sharks. I see reef back, so that's a good sign. And that's bad. Because it means I gotta rely entirely on the sonar system. So if something comes into my periphery and rush. Like that! Hi! Oh, hey, wait, is this one of the life pods? No way! Excuse you! F off! I have a knife! Where'd my boat go? Oh, there it is. Yeah, how much health do you have left? Let me heal you. Please. Let me repair you! I know you're hurting, darling. A toy car, for some reason. An abandoned GDA. A hat. Is that freaking Markiplier? Data. I scan this. Isn't that like copyright infringement or something? An unusual doll. Anything else? Found a pen. Well, that was relatively pointless. Okay, but where are we in comparison to the floating island? straight down from the floating island, we should be fine. If I can freaking find the dang place, there it is. Oh good, the land's all glitched out. undertones. I'm saving. You can't hurt me if I save. Well, you can, but then I'll come back later annoyed. And probably stab happy. Time capsule! 
Oh my goodness! Time capsule! What'd I get? Stuff you may need. Press to view. This may never be found, but here are stuff you may need in your travels. I got two advanced wiring kits. Good, I needed to make those. That's why I came out here in the first place. Two enameled glass and two synthetic fibers. That's like the most useful freaking junk I've ever seen. And there's stuff over here. A torpedo arm? Oh, whoa! It's another one of those weird alien vents. Have I scanned these yet? I have not. Neato. That's a lot of stuff down there. I'd rather not. I would much well rather Captain. explore this and maybe find the ingredients I need to make the drill arm. Where? That loud screech means warper. And warper means I need to get the heck, I need to identify where it is or I'm gonna get snapped. Blueprint acquired. Well, I guess I already had that one. Torpedo arm fragment, have it. Uh, can I get into the wreck? Hello? Can I enter you? Yeah, I can! Power cell charger fragment. Oh, I already have that. I heard that! I have a knife! Knife! It's a knife! It's gonna stab you! In the neck! Do warpers have necks? I'm gonna stab you somewhere! <laughs> I am waiting for the day that I just like cut open one of these and there is a warper just on the other side of the door just like Uh I do not have much of a clue Near blueprint acquired I mean like so I I I'm kind of like going through this in general uh, so, like, I'm not really too experienced. I killed one of the Reaper Leviathans. I looked up, I, I asked, I asked if they could be killed, and I got instructions that I could freeze it with the stasis rifle and, and stab it repeatedly, and it actually worked. And then just about 20 minutes ago, I ran myself over with my own Seamoth and died. So, you know, it's, it's kind of give and take. It's like sometimes I'm awesome and sometimes, sometimes I am a blatant idiot. Oh, good. Well, let me tell you, I'm actually disappointed because I found this, this deep area with like green goo on the ocean floor. And I, okay, there's stuff in there, and I'm also out of oxygen, almost. That's kind of why I wanted to play the game. Um, and you can always just catch, like, all the old highlight reels of some of the best moments. Yes, I know, 30 seconds. Um, but friggin', I found these weird eggs that turned out to be this really cute fish. The, 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 the cuddle fish or something. And I, I already hatched one of them. 
And then I found two more. One in like the, the, the lost habitat place. And then another one in this alien cache that I opened with the orange tablet. And then I swam into the green goo and died and lost two eggs. And I was so upset. Because those, those, those are cute. And I still can't find the drill. Oh yeah, we, we ran into the ghost Leviathan. Well, we didn't run into it, but uh, we saw it. <laughs> We saw it, and then we immediately just ka put it in reverse! <laughs> just throw it in reverse, and beep! 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 Nope! Down of there! I did find the parents. There was this, there was this place. I know about the void. Like that's 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 one of the few things I know about Subnautica. Um, because like you know when when Subnautica first dropped, there were tons of reactions all over the internet of YouTubers react to encountering the Reaper, and then and obviously the void. Um, but I found this like place with one of the Degasi habitats that had like these blue orbs that were like suspended by rope. And there was a big ghost leviathan running around there. And it was like way bigger than the one I saw in the, I think you called it the Lost River. So, oh, and also, I don't know why, but when I dove the sea moth into that green goop in the Lost River, it started burning and then it would not stop losing hell even when I got it all the way back here and it just died on me. And I had to build an entire second sea moth. Thankfully, I managed to, to get the upgrades out of it before it, it blew up on me, but it was, like, I could not sustain a, a, a... How's everyone doing in here? You all happy living your communal life? I'm gonna start the Danganronpa music eventually and make you all kill each other. Okay, have fun. Why are there eggs? I did not authorize egg laying! I think I can manage most of it. Like, I have a friend who, like, dramatically suggested that I play this and said they would give me tips. Toy car. I have a toy car, apparently. Cool. I'll put that with the other junk. <laughs> Alright, well, we did find something incredible. I found a time capsule that was just chock full of super useful stuff, so... Yay! First off, let me... Let me plant this, this thing. And second off... Oh, you can buy those? Oh, cool. I may have to get one. Second off, let me see what I can construct. What do I need for the Cyclops? Let's see. I need a plasteel ingot, enamel glass, lubricant, and lead. Well, I have... I think I have everything I need. Am I going to be able to make a Cyclops? Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I know I stashed the enamel glass around here somewhere. Uh, titanium ingots. I need two more titanium. Well, I may have to get one then. All right. 
I know there's lithium over here somewhere. I forget where, though. Which locker are you in? There you are. And then I need lead. Three lead. One, two, three lead. Lead? No, dead. Ah, I need to make the plasteel. Plasteel. I don't know why plastic steel comes from a lithium ion battery and a bunch of titanium, but here we are. Dragon? Uh. Hang on, let me check. Hello, yes! Is there a dragon up here? Hello! Don't see any dragons. Don't tell me there's an above water threat if not the cave crawlers. Oh, is it like underwater? Oh, lordy. I gotta go deep, don't I? I mean, I already gotta go deep. I got this stupid infection. And then on top of that, there's a giant laser that shot down my ship. Or my escape ship. Despite my best efforts. Deadlier! Deadlier! Great! That is... It eats them? It eats Reaper Leviathans! No! Huh? No! How big is this thing? Never mind, I don't want to know. Like, ugh, it freaking breathes fire and it's underwater anyway because screw you. Lava, of course. There's always a magma zone. Right well, it makes sense. We are in this weird, like, area. Do I still not have the. I don't have lube. Gathered all this rare material, and what's the one thing I forget? The lubricant. Eh, it can't be that bad, can it? Look, if I can kill a Reaper Leviathan with a knife, I'm pretty sure the stasis rifle will work on anything. It should be fine, eventually. Maybe. Button. Whoa! That thing's big. The Cyclops is designed to be operated by a three-person crew. Only experienced Helms people should attempt to pilot this vehicle solo. It's huge! Oh my! Wow! This thing is humongous! All systems online. Built in lockers. Launch bay. Okay. This is the engine. It has six power cells! Oh! I can build in here? Oh my goodness. That's awesome. Oh, here's the engine. Hang on, I have a thing for this. Boop. 
Go to fabricator. No vehicle dock. Oh, can I dock something here? I slip and fall. I bet I can dock the sea moth. Oh, it's so cool! Ah! Hang on. Deep Typhoon. Uh, 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 we'll see what this looks like on the outside in a moment. Gotta go with the orange and purple color scheme. Alright, let's see what this thing looks like. Jeez. I'm excited. Oh, that's a beautiful thing. Needs to be a little bit darker orange, but eh, good enough. I can fix that. I can fix that. That's fine. That's easy. It's dumb easy. There we go. More like red orange. Castle. I don't know what you're talking. Oh wait, hang on. I think I remember something about some like deep. Oh, now it looks like. Now that looks like a submarine. Of course, a dragon projects a castle. Of course it does. Well, let me say this much. That seems like a good spot to end it for the night because we've been going for bacteria levels in the water. Performing a self-scan is advised. Okay, fine. I'll do a self-scan. Oh, look. I already did that. Nothing new happened. Anyway, that seems like a good spot as any ended. So, for those of you watching the VOD, this is Fearless Falcon signing off. See you later. And for those of you